All right, today we have a clip of Matt Walsh talking about the African American studies uh, in Florida. Let's take a look. And uh, there's just no chance that in, uh, in the modern age, in the government school system, they can have any course related to something like African American studies that will not be highly political, uh, ideologically charged. I wonder why, I wonder why Matt Walsh thinks I wonder why he's saying that there can't be something like uh, African American studies, an AP African American course for high school students that are planning to go into college that isn't highly politicized or ideologically driven. I wonder why he's saying that. I wonder who it is who's politicizing uh, this college course. It's literally a history course. It's literally a history course that is teaching uh, the history of a uh, group of people that literally built this fucking country okay uh it, it's history and it's important to know history for so many different reasons i mean i I'm, i can't i i don't even i don't need to explain that but it, it's ron DeSantis and uh people like matt walsh that are saying that this is politicized but then they're the ones who are politicizing it and also again I mean, if you read what the college board put out for these African American studies and uh, what the course entails, uh, it, you know, it says it covers a very uh, a, a wide variety of different topics when it comes to uh, this this specific issue, and there's going to be uh, politics and political decision making. And politicians have played a huge, huge part in how African Americans have been treated in this country and how systemic racism has uh, played out against people like African Americans in this country. So I, I, that, I don't understand how they can say something like that when, number one, they're the ones politicizing it, and number two, you can't, I, I don't see how you could teach about african-american studies and not talk about systemic racism which has been largely uh perpetuated in many many different ways by our government like i, I mean how how can you argue against that maybe the maybe matt walsh and ron DeSantis, maybe they need to take this course so they can learn maybe they do i don't know because i i mean i again i don't see how you can say something like that and yeah include things like Queer theory. Uh, uh, queer theory. I don't know what... Uh, he played a clip of Ron DeSantis talking about the course and saying that it's against Florida's laws because it includes queer theory, and he was saying that that's uh, an attempt to drive children into some uh, gender-based uh, ideals that they're not the right gender or something like that he doesn't understand what queer theory is i guarantee you he doesn't even know what queer theory is uh in basic terms queer theory is just literally uh debunking a lot of societal uh it, it's it's kind of like debunking uh, what a lot of people assume about uh, people that are queer, like uh, stuff like, you know, if you're gay, you have AIDS, stuff like that. Not specifically that. That's just an example I'm using. I didn't know how to word what I was trying to say there, but um, stuff, stuff like that in a way. Um, because that's, uh, that is going to be, that's going to be uh, shoehorned into Anything, anything, anything where the left is involved, um, it's always going to come down to LGBT indoctrination. It's all, it See, I, 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 anywhere where the left is involved, I mean, I don't see how, how is African American studies the left? How does that just equate being on the left? Studying history, that's a... That's a leftist trait. I mean, that's if that's if that's true, then that's great. I mean, I don't have a, I you know, I think I, I think a lot of the time, you know, uh, kind of assigning these labels. I'm on the left. I'm on the right. You know, I mean, does that what is what does that really do? You know, I I, I personally, you know, I think that that sometimes that is just uh, a waste of time. But if that's 
if that's something that people that like me and that I believe do, then I'm I'm totally for that. I mean, I I I think history is important. Again, knowing history is uh, important for so many different reasons that I'm not going to explain because I don't need to explain them. But it, it's it's always a forum for that. I mean, look at look at BLM before they changed their website. You know, originally on their website when they listed their uh, what their mission statement is. All over their mission statement about trans rights, LGBT this, LGBT that. What does that have to do with Black Lives Matter? He doesn't, they, these people, do they really not understand? I saw a clip of Ben Shapiro a couple days ago uh, talking about uh, Black Lives Matter and uh, Daniel Shaver, who was someone who was uh, just literally executed by a police officer. He was a white man who was executed by a white police officer. And he was saying something like, uh, the police can't be, they can't be racist. They can't be white supremacists because look at this guy. He's a white guy that got shot by a white cop. So the police can't be inherently racist because of that reason. And uh, if you go and look, and this is something you guys can look up. I know I say that a lot, but you can go and look this up. Uh, the Black Lives Matter uh, uh, movement, the people that associate themselves with Black Lives Matter, they were uh, they were there when Daniel Shaver got killed. They were absolutely uh, people that uh, the Black Lives Matter people, people that are part of the Black Lives Matter movement, they uh, s stood in solidarity. They talked about Daniel Shaver. They tried to raise awareness about Daniel Shaver. And Matt Walsh is saying this stuff like, what does LGBTQ have to do with, uh, you know, stuff like BLM? He doesn't understand what a movement is. He really doesn't get it. He does not understand. He hears the phrase BLM or he hears the acronym or the, he, heard, he hears Black Lives Matter and his brain is uh, so one-dimensional. He just thinks, well, then that's all, that's all that they care about is black people and their lives like that's what he thinks and i don't understand that i don't understand how he can just be so one-dimensional so simple-minded like it's not just because that's what it stands for just because it's black lives matter that's not the only thing that they are talking about that's not the only thing that the movement black lives matter uh, represents not the only thing that they are trying to raise awareness about at police brutality in general things like lgbtqia plus issues in general it's not just black lives matter like how they want you to think it is i i feel like that's another thing i don't need to explain but that's because that's a cover for just a far left agenda as he accurately points out Though I'll also say that I'm not in favor of, uh, you know, you hear some conservatives say, well, we've got to reform. We need to reform this program. We need to take a look at it. We need to audit it and figure out a way to. No, we don't need this at all. Okay, this is not an appropriate or relevant thing. Why? Why is it not appropriate? I think it's extremely appropriate and it's very relevant. What the fuck is he talking about? How is history not relevant? That's the one of the most relevant things you can teach children. And you can teach young people is fucking history, the history of uh what has happened to cause the societal uh issues that we are dealing with now that minority groups have to deal with now. What is he talking about? I know he's a white man, so he doesn't really have issues he has to deal with except for people attacking him on Twitter. But what the fuck is he talking about? What do you mean it's not relevant? How is it not relevant? What the fuck is relevant then? I, 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 don't, I, I, I don't get that at all. It, it's not relevant. It, we don't need this at all. We absolutely need that. That's, we absolutely need to learn our history. It's, it, it's a saying that everybody says. You hear it a lot when you're little. Uh, you know, if you don't know your history, you're doomed to repeat it. You need to know your history. It's just, it's, it's, in, it's important to know history. It's important to know how we got to where we're at now. I don't understand how Matt Walsh doesn't know that. I know he's just trying to, 
perpetuate this uh, narrative of outrage of look at what they're trying to do. You know, uh, you know, these people are the ones that are evil. They're evil. The left is evil. They're trying to push gender ideology. You know, white people, white kids aren't as good as black kids, stuff like that. But it's just it's so dumb. It's just it's so easy to see through. Like, what are we doing? Kind of African-American history or studies that should not be a course that is offered or presented in grade school, in public schools. But he's not giving a reason why. That's my issue with this clip at this point. I know he's a fucking idiot. I know that he, again, he's just trying to manufacture this fake outrage story. So people are talking about, they look and they say, oh, well, look at what they're trying to do. Like, why? Give a fucking reason. Back that reason up with sufficient evidence that proves your point stop saying shit without providing a reason it shouldn't be offered because it's it's not relevant how is that an argument why should it not be offered matt fucking tell me please i hope he explains this this clip's almost over there's only 30 seconds left i really need him to explain this because this is uh getting ridiculous at this point how fucking just dumb he's being beating around the bush like this it shouldn't be there at all shouldn't be and there why at is all that because here we go you know what maybe i was wrong maybe he's gonna tell us why there shouldn't be african-american studies let's let's hear the reason what we should be teaching kids is oh. oh god i didn't th oh god oh jesus Okay. Okay. And why is that? Because what we should be teaching kids is American history. Motherfucker. What the fuck? What the fuck? It, bro, um, African American history, that's still fucking history. What the fuck? That's American history, too. What the fuck are you talking about? American history, aka about the white people. Look at his, look at his smug little face, bro. What are you talking about? American history. Are black people not American? What the fuck, it, bro? African American studies, Matt. It's in the fucking name, Matt. He lit that. <laughs> It's so much dumber than I thought it was going to be. We should we shouldn't be teaching them African American history uh, African American studies. We should be teaching them American studies American history. What? You just took out the African part. They didn't even give that's not even a reason. You didn't even say anything. What is American history? Just the white people? Is that all you want to talk about, Matt? Is the white people? Do black people really make you that uncomfortable? I don't under. He didn't. That's he didn't. He did not even say anything. We shouldn't be teaching them black history. We should be teaching them American history. What? That's. It's all. It's. It's the same fucking thing, Matt. It's all one and the same because they're a part of this country, whether you like it or not, whether Ronald Santos likes it or not, whether you guys are gonna try to do fascism or not. It's not gonna fucking work. You cannot whitewash history this hard and expect people to take you seriously this is ridiculous it's overtly ridiculous what the fuck is he saying do people really look at this man and think he's smart i i can't in grade school in public schools it shouldn't be there at all and why is that because what we should be teaching kids is american history that's it. The course, the course, it should. What the fuck is American? What is that, Matt? What the fuck is American history? America's history, America, American history. Okay, I know I'm like losing my shit over here. American history is terrible. It's awful. There are so many goddamn terrible things this country has done to people that were here before us. To people that we, uh, to people that are here now, there are so many terrible, 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 terrible fucking things America has done. So, uh, what is the American history we're supposed to be learning about? 
because I'm confused. What is American history that doesn't somehow entail African Americans in any way, shape, or form? Because according to Matt, that's what American history is. I, just, just say it, Matt. Stop being a. Stop doing this dog whistle bullshit and just say I'm a fucking racist. Just say I don't like black people. Stop being a bitch about it. Stop being a little fucking pussy and say it. I'm so tired of these conservatives fucking acting like this. Fucking just come out and be like, I'm a fucking racist. I don't like black people. Just say it. Stop saying this stupid fucking uh, example. American history. D dude, that's you literally don't even have anything to say. That is nothing. Word salad. Be focused on American history not breaking history what is american history he's not going to explain it because american history includes african-american studies african-american history as well and he's not going to say something like that because again that would make his entire argument fucking invalid this entire thing he's been talking about right now would literally not be anything if he said anything like that at all down I by racial groups the moment you start to do that it is again going to automatically become politically political and ideological He's I, 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 I do not understand how grown ass white men like Matt Walsh are seriously too fucking stupid to, I don't even think he knows what he's saying. I mean, I really don't because everything that's pouring out of his mouth is unbelievably, ridiculously just unabashedly fucking just uh, idiotic not breaking history down by racial groups breaking history down by racial groups i i i really don't think he even understands it does he even know what he's saying can he hear himself the moment you start to do that it is again going to automatically become politically political and ideological but it's also not appropriate for a public school environment. Teach the Why is it not appropriate for a public school environment? When is it appropriate to teach something like that, Matt Walsh? Is it not appropriate to teach especially, especially the people that are not African American? I, I, I think that they, they absolutely need to, should, and want, I'm sure that they want to and would need to learn it too, but is it not uh, just as, if not more important, to teach the people that are not African American, like white boy Matt Walsh, uh, like people that look like me, uh, this type of history? How is that not important? How is that not appropriate? How? How, how is that not appropriate? Explain that to me. Again, they're trying to make it seem like this course is uh, teaching white children that they're not as they're not uh, good good enough because their their skin's white compared to people that have the black skin. I I, I don't know. I, I'm 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 giving up on this one, guys. I I don't know how. Uh, I I just I don't even know. So fucking. I, I I don't even know what he's saying. I I don't even know how he, if he knows what he's saying. If he's if it's not appropriate to teach young people, when is it appropriate to teach it? Like it's like I said, just Matt Walsh, just come out and say it. Just be like, oh, we're gonna, just gonna do uh you know I'm just gonna do racism straight up. Uh, we're also gonna just uh go along with the fascism that Ron DeSantis is doing down in Florida. Uh, you know. Yeah, I don't like black people. There it is. Matt Walsh, just say it. Just say it, Matt. Stop beating around the bush. Stop fucking being a pussy about it. Tell it like it is. Tell it like how you really feel, Matt. I mean, it's, it's fucking, I, I don't know. Kids, American history. What is American history? He never explains what American history is. I don't understand that. Matt, please, tell me what American history is. There's five seconds left in the clip. I don't think he's going to. And that will include the story of everyone who has been an American. So the white people. That's what American history is, I guess, just the white people. I, 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 he didn't even explain it. I don't know what American history is. Again, it's literally African-American history, and then he said we shouldn't be teaching them African-American history. We should just be teaching them American history. 
which is just this it's again I, again I, I i don't know i don't know guys I, um but uh that's gonna be it for this one um if you guys like the video then hit the like button uh it really helps me out a lot and if you want to see more content like this then go on over and hit that subscribe button and hit that little bell and turn on all notifications so you never miss an upload